Do you know why an arrow zooms off when released from a bow? Consider all the aspects of this motion. First, the string of the bow is stretched. The energy for this is supplied by the muscles of the hand and this energy is transferred to the bow causing the string to stretch. When the arrow is released, the energy in the stretched string is transferred to the arrow and so it takes off. Let us try to understand this with an experiment. We need a spring balance and a toy with a key. First, we will take the spring balance and pull this hook down. As we pull this down, observe that the spring inside the balance is getting stretched. The energy that we expend to pull the spring down gets stored in the spring. The spring now has the potential to do work. The energy in the stretched string is called potential energy. Now we will release this hook and see what happens. The spring snaps back to the initial position. So the potential energy stored in the spring was used to do work. This is movement. Every object always tries to release excess potential energy it has by doing some work. In our next example, we will take a spring powered toy duck and wind its key. When we release this duck, you will see that it starts moving. Can you explain what happened? When we wind the key, the spring inside stores the work we have done in winding in the form of potential energy and when we release the key, the spring releases its potential energy slowly, transforming it into an energy which moves the duck. The energy contained in the moving duck is called kinetic energy. Potential energy is energy stored in a body as a result of its position, while kinetic energy is the energy contained in a body because of its motion. So in the case of the arrow, the energy in the stretched string is potential energy and the energy in the moving arrow is its kinetic energy.